On Monday, 20th October, AWS went down. It was specific to a particular region, US East 1 in North Virginia, USA. North Virginia is called the cloud capital of the world, and for AWS, it is the largest data center too. So, when it went down, it took down Snapchat, Zoom, Roblox, Fortnite, Canva, Slack, Reddit, impacting 1,000 plus companies and services. Amazon lost $72 million per hour, while Snapchat and Reddit lost around $6 lakh and $1.5 lakh per hour respectively. The AWS outage lasted for around 15 hours. The issue occurred due to DNS resolution issue which affected DynamoDB. DynamoDB is a fully managed serverless NoSQL database service like MongoDB. The issue then had domino effects. EC2, Lambda, CloudWatch, SQS, and Redshift all went down. Even as the internet hosts billions of applications and services, a majority of them are running on cloud services offered by AWS, Microsoft, or Google. AWS still holds 30% of market alone, followed by Azure and Google, which have 20% and 40% cloud market share, respectively. So with AWS down, a major chunk of companies from startup to Fortune 500 experienced service outages, including banks and airlines. We have seen such over-reliance on a single vendor before, which caused a massive aviation and banking sector disruption due to a faulty Windows CrowdStrike update.